Hello everyone and welcome back as we're getting closer and closer and closer to the competition which is not doing good for my anxiety. However, we are making progress as you guys will see um, today. Uh, Mushroom Mai apparently is uh, not going to good, get that good because uh, we kind of destroyed that area. Oh, increased value for poison cures and uh, <laughs> poison Mai, okay sure. And increased value for fire tonics. I can at least sell one of my fire tonics then, that's good. And uh, Roxanne is still destroying my mana potions, but you know what? That's fine. Two days until the competition. If you aren't prepared yet, now is the time. Remember, you must craft the potions prior to the contest. Don't put it off. I'm not. I have my potions right, right ahead over here. I hope. Oh, I already had like one prepared anyway. So that's good. Uh, okay, so... <sighs> Can we do it? I hope so. <laughs> uh, but uh, look at that. Look at this beautiful, beautiful mana potion. A perfect brew. Greater mana potion level 2. Really, really nice. So we, we, we've got that one. So the only thing left is really just mana potion. Oh, health potion, that is. Um, but. We don't have anything that's strong on green just yet, which is the uh, the worrisome part. Come on. There you go. Um, yeah. There was also... We need to make a, a fire tonic. So... For that one we need a red and... and well, A and C. Do we have anything that gives both of them? Oh yeah, these ones, right? Might as well just use like a like a tiny one because we need to make like common ones, not the uh, the bigger ones, you know. I'm just gonna go ahead and put two of you. What was the the other one? It's not you. Oh, it's the slime. What was the slime one? Perfect. And um, it seems like we need. Four time for that one, so no, <laughs> we're not gonna wait four days for that. Uh, two time slots for that, or oh, four time slots for that one. We're only gonna wait two time slots for that one. Um, we can, we could go explore. I don't have that much money, and we need like four hundred to upgrade uh, our cauldron area. So that's. It's gonna stay also, like, not yet to do, you know? Um, I also don't have that many potions. Like, we have mana potions. However, they're getting really destroyed by by thingy. So, we don't want to do that. Um, so, instead, we might go travel and we might go buy stuff. As well as see what Mint has all for us. There's still sand in my boots, but I showed that desert who's boss. You did indeed. What is that thing? Rough, a rot fly cocoon. It's a good yellow one. Ooh, that's good. What is this one? It's a, ooh, it's a really good green one. <sighs> very nice, very nice, very nice. And we even got like one of these, so that's good. We also need to get more of these, though. But good job, Mint. Might send you there. Oh wait, mm, can I send you there again? I could, yeah. Like, this is gonna send you all the way through, I think, right? Yeah, look at that. Yeah, that should be fine. I wish I'd like the side uh, one to give uh, like a ten percent boost. But, you know what? I think we're fine. I'm gonna send you in once again. So that one should be fine. Let's go see what Baptiste has for us. I only bought like a few things last time, so that's fine. The quest was a success. We had the spoils. Yeah, I bought like these roots because they were really, really good for green. Which we need. And also Courtier's Orchid. Ooh. That one is good as well. So we might 
Let me see. What do you have? Ooh. I might come back here. Because first things first, I want to go to... Wait. Do I have enough? <laughs> Should I upgrade my... My cauldron? Like, I can get ma more magaments in there. Like, stronger magaments. But do I need that? Or do I need more ingredients? I'm gonna wait. You know what? I'm gonna wait a little bit more. We're gonna try to get, like, better ingredients again. Because, uh... Like, we're already seeing, like, a ton of good stuff, right? So... We need to just get, like, more of these. This is gonna make the... The bone waste, like, completely wasted, but... I think that's fine. And also, we're gonna be out of money. Which is fine. It's okay. I don't need the money. I don't need the money. Like, at least, like, this game... Like, since you use, like, a lot of your money up, like, instantly, you're always, like, on low amount of money. At least in the beginning. Um, so, up, oh, expand 30 ingredients in one playthrough. Oh, oh, yeah, of course. I'm getting, like, what the? That one, that one too. Eat that cocoon, uh, Quinn. Nice. Thank you. Give me a day and they'll come in stock. I know. Like some things here are... Oh wait, yeah. I, they are red because I can't buy them. <laughs> because I have no money. Oh, I might, might want to get one of these. So thank you. Have zero money. <laughs> That's an achievement. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> okay, um... Oh, these things are so big, however. Like, I wonder what, what is the, like, considered the best color. Because we can't see, like, fungus is gold. Oh, that's a... Oh, wait, maybe it's not... No, wait, look at that. This one is golden slime, right? This one is silver slime. Which one is better? I'm pretty sure it's the gold one. Like these two are both like brown, which I'm gonna say is like bronze. So that's like the weakest one. I'm gonna say like gold is like, yeah, okay. Like silver is rank two, bronze is rank one, gold is rank three. And then you have diamond, which is rank four. And I'm gonna guess that they might be a rank 5 but it's not a hundred percent sure because uh, we have like a few already that are like diamond rank which I, I feel like it's a little bit too early to get like the highest of the highest ranks you know um how about that I did a thing yep you did no, you can go rest I might go with Batiste and uh, just hang out with him with him uh, I have no money I was just want, I just wanted to say hello. Have a blessed day, you too. Okay, Baptist, let's uh, rank you up then. I'm not especially busy. Upgrading cotton can increase their magnet and green limits. Yeah, I know. That's why they are red and blue, uh, green. I don't mind. I trust you don't mind if I multitask. Your arrival coincident to the package delivery. Wait, your arrival coincident, coin, coincide, coin, coincided with the package delivery, and the mail from the mainland has proven so irregular. I find myself quite eager to see what's inside. No, oh, I'm curious too. Rips into the package with an unrestrained joy of a little kid with a birthday present. His glee intensifies when he sees the content. Oh, that's cute. Ah, oh, well, would you look at that? My favorite brand of conditioner. You can't find this in after. Oh, and the extra silky dental floss. I do have sensitive gums. This is for my mother. She must have known I had missed some of the comforts of home. Oh, that's kind of her. 
It is, except now I feel absent even more keenly than before. Tell me, Sylvia, what is your pedigree? My what? Your pedigree, your background, who are your people? I, I come from good start folk. My parents started with basically nothing, but they worked hard their whole lives. They instilled that work ethic in, in me, so I put myself through college, and now here I am, running a business. Oh, I love it! Your parents sound respectable. The soul of the earth type. My own background is quite different from yours. <laughs> you don't say. My father is the Duke of Ambervale. He owes his fortune to his crude investment in decisions. Uh, decisions. Concerning investments made with some, uh, with a somewhat smaller fortune he inherited from my grandparent, the previous Duke of Ambervale. My great grandfather was a lowly baron, a bit of a black sheep. But my great great grandfather actually established the very first Eros Guild. Oh, so you're in the family business. That is right. Although it has been some time since any of us really got our hands dirty in the daily operations. <laughs> my brothers ended up with, a c with cushy positions on the continent. They told me I was mad coming here. I say they don't know what they're missing. Lately I've been thinking about it that it's necessary, even desirable, to get your hands dirty from time to time. How else can you truly get to know a place, particularly a place that crafta? This island is untidy, but that's what makes it so fascinating and filled to breast bursting with opportunity. For riches or romance? Or even a bit of both? Indeed, there is room in my life for more of it. And I can always use more allies too, particularly among the town's craftspeople. So I very much want you to succeed, Sylvia. I, in fact, I sympathize with you quite a bit. If you can establish this sort of rapport with your customers, you'll be off to a fine start. Ooh. If opener, apply sympathy for two turns. That's a good one. Sure. I'll even make puppy dog eyes if they op if it will happen, open their wallets. Oh, excellent. Now, if there's anything I can help you with... If not, I should get back to the grindstones. I understand. I'm being literal. We just received a large shipment of grindstones, and it falls to me to unload them all. Hm, I guess the guildmaster's work is never done. No, indeed. I wanted to get my hands dirty, and I'm getting that. So let's hope I don't regret that uh, impulse. Yeah, very good. But this is like a lot more grounded than I uh, sort of expected him to be. I can rank up again. <laughs> However, I need to go home. I have something brewing at home. Did I? Hmm. Did I use up all my mo my mana potions? No, I did not. Okay, good. Oh, I thought I did for a second. <laughs> but we needed to get like, um, well, some of these. So let's get these done. Is it a perfect brew? It was a perfect brew, but it's not good enough. But we already had that one done anyway, so that's fine. Um, now anyway. Let's go ahead and make ourselves... Wait, how good are you? Are you three? Three slots. Yeah, that's that's nice, at least. Um, and now for... Ooh, wait, 27? It's gonna be a hard one to get. Like, I don't think I... Yeah, I don't think I have anything that's like... That can remove my 13 from this one. Oh wait, I'm an idiot. What I can do, however, is use my second one, because we did have two of them, so that I can use another one of the that octopus. Or maybe I can use the other one that I had. Which one was it? I had like a second item that was uh, really good with a uh, Magimite. No, it was not you. I might have used that one up. And now we need just a simple fruit berry. And there you go. And there you go. That's already perfect. And now we just need... Uh, maybe something that gives a good smell, you know? And what is the green one? Oh, yeah, there you go. That's... Oh, wait, no, that's not the green one. Uh, you were the green one. Perfect. And see? That's gonna get, like... Perfectly done. Brew. <laughs> nope. 
Hey. Wait, you, why can you... Why highlight it with the spray all potions? Why not highlight it? Like, why can't I have this? I can't put potions into my potions. Interesting. No, okay, it doesn't work. Where's my uh, mushroom then again? Thank you. Mushroom. And what I needed to do is use one oak wood. There you go. That should be good enough then, I think. Right? Yes. But there you go. With this, we also have like all of our... Uh, all of our um, potions that we needed to get. And they're all even one tier higher, or two stars higher, than what they needed to be. So that's good. Whew. I was scared for a second, to be honest. But I think we're still good. Um, you know what else, though? <laughs> like, we, we're getting our... Like... Come on. Fine, I'll put them in then. That was 160. I, I got less money from that one. Oh, well, I guess that's fine. I am making more money from it. Okay, fine. I'm gonna put them in the correct <laughs> box then. <laughs> there you go. That's some good money. I can go out and uh, talk some more and even get like buy some more as well wait i'm missing the uh i'm missing the the mushroom ah, i shouldn't have not have used up all my mushrooms to make this even though it it is nice it, it looks really good it does help a little bit but i could have already like a second cauldron spot um, ducted upon return to shop. Yeah, I know. I guess we can take, we can spend some more time with uh, Baptiste then. Because why not? Welcome back to the guild hall. Yeah, I'm back here to uh, to take some more time with you, the, to spend some more time with you. Why not? And it, Baptist Zero Expeditions are really good. It's like, forgive the sheen of dampness upon my brow, Sylvia. I have been playing more than a little elbow uh, elbow grease around the guild hall today. Don't hurt yourself. Oh, it isn't anything too arduous. At the moment, I'm just giving the heroes achievements and the all overdue polish. No pressure. But if you can, uh, you can help out if you like. Oh, I don't have any battery on my phone. <laughs> That's fine. Shows an area of trophies plated in gold, silver, bronze, and platinum. Oh, platinum is the the, the fourth tier then. She, the, she takes a rag and helps uh, polishing. Various engraving. Slime buster. Kill five slimes. Slime there. Kill fifty slimes. Slime bane. Kill five fucked slimes. That one took, must take ages to earn. Oh, it's a useful motivation tool. Some of these heroes are real trophy chasers. Sylvia notices that pa Baptiste is uh, very slow. <laughs> Not that he's slacking. His own one trophy gleams brighter than any of Sylvia's. It's probably a shiny that the day was made. Baptiste, it seems, is a perfectionist. If so, he has his work laid out for him. Oh, he has his work cut out for him here. Thank you for your assistance uh, today, Sylvia. Although I can't help but feel this tack is only the smallest drop in the bucket. Can I ask you, if you don't mind, to rate our cleanliness? Be brutally honest now. What do you think of the, the state of the guild hall? I could eat off these floors. It's so clean in here. Oh, I, w I wish you wouldn't. And I'm not sure I fully believe you. It's this place. It just seems to attract dirt no matter how much I clean. But I've got bad news for dirt. I won't back down from a challenge. If I went and things seemed easy, I wouldn't have petitioned for this job. Oh, tell me more. Why did you want this job anyway? You must have had a lot of options. A fewer options than you might expect. For while it is true that I am the son of a duke, I am in fact the third son of a duke. 
My father liked to call us the heir, the spare, and the stand over there. My brothers had already made rules waiting for them with the Eros Guild, main office. Prestigious positions, but cushy to the point of being almost purely ceremonial. My choices were to be third in command there, to be comfortable but utterly superfluous, or to come here where the guild still faces legitimate and significant challenges. Oh, what sort of challenges? I had the impression things were going smoothly. That's the official line, but this island is all but overrun with strange creatures, many of which don't appear in any bestiary. So we have a cut, a work cut out for us, but it's dangerous work. My recruitment drive has attracted some well-known old-timers and a few promising up-and-comers, but we're losing people faster than we're gaining them. Oh, I didn't realize the mortality rate was so high. Oh, you may not understand me. I'm not talking about anything so dire as that. I mean, certainly. Some of our recruits have been eaten or melted, but it's quite a small percentage. The real issue is retention. It has been difficult to attract good talent and near impossible to hold on to it. But I remain undeterred. Uh, I, I will fill our ranks with the best and the brightest. I will achieve and surpass the standards set by generations of heroic endeavors. I blast it. I will get that stain out of the, the table runner. You must watch me. Oh. I like a man with conviction. I can see you're very passionate. Oh, and I'm more than willing to share my passion with others. People think they know what to expect from someone on my demeanor. That only makes it easier to pull the rug out. Maybe you could try a bit of subversion in your own negotiations. Oh, that's a good one. A debuff. Flipping the script. Sounds fun. Oh, it can be. So get out there and put the screws in your customer. Unless you're in the mood for a bit more scrubbing first. Ah, we can help you scrub some more. Because uh, apparently we didn't scrub that. Stop getting... <laughs> Stop wanting so many rank ups! <laughs> Fairly well. It's like, ah, yes. You want more? <laughs> There's still sand in my boots. Oh, what is this? Leech snail shell. Ooh. Red and green, that's just what I was wa wanting. More red and green, even more what I was wanting. And a ton of cactus. And the salamander's fiery tongue. Ooh, that's a lot of green. That's very nice, very nice, very nice. You know I'm game. I know you are. Uh, I need you to go to the mushroom mire. Oh, you're level 5 now. Very nice. I just want you to defeat two of them and then come back. Yeah, I think that's fine. Just defeat those two and come back. If you bring in a... Uh a mushroom, then I will be more than happy. More happy than you might imagine. Uh, and there you go. We now have a kind of a few more things to expand with. This thing, this thing, and that thing. Salamander's fiery tongue. They're not bad. They're really good, so to say, really. But, that's good. Cool, hand them over. It's like, oh yes, fiery tongue. Whoo! That's hot. That's hoo hoo hot. Um. And yeah, you have the best ingredients in town. I know. That's why I come over here to buy your stuff. Um. Let's see then. Oh, I don't have that many of the sack of slimes. So you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and buy them then. We're gonna need them, I think. Oh, you're expensive. You've got a little bit more expensive. That's fine. Oh, eh, maybe not. <laughs> I do need something with blue. Oh, yeah. Now I have some more powerful green and, uh, and red ones. So I can make the... The potion ones, now can I? Or can't I? I don't think I had any of the, the jelly, right? Yeah, I didn't have any. So that's good. Um, do I want the gold dollop? No, I don't think so. These things also, like... It's not worth it. 
yet to buy those things. We're also waiting. I might maybe I need a few of these. Thank you. And also some of these unicorn horns. I'm gonna go ahead and buy ten of them then. And I think I need to go buy more more fuel as well. Because the uh the potions are taking a lot longer now. Mm, I have three of these, two of these. And buy three of uh yeah, three of these, one of these. That should be fine. And how much do I need for that? I need one dose. And a bit more money, but you know what? The money is fine. Uh see you again. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, I can also rank up with you. But we're not gonna do that just yet. I could upgrade that one. Should I do that then? Because I do have the money now. Like, I do have spendable money. I'm gonna... Might as well do it then. What is this one then? That one needs a beat. Ooh, we do have the beat and we do... We almost have enough money. So that should be good. So let's go back home. Bye-bye, Muktok. <clears throat> that's gonna be good though Cause that's gonna allow us to use like some of the, the higher difficulty ones uh, for the brews come on give me that -hoo -hoo. very very nice and now yeah there you go look at that recommended competition points I have all three which is very nice yeah, Dogo, don't mind me. <laughs> My dog just came here and like, wah, 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 wah. <laughs> like, what do you want? Uh, yeah, look at that. Hmm. Yeah, the poison, it needs 18. Do I have anything that's like 18 yellow straight up? I have this thing. Like one of these and one of these is gonna be enough. Come on. Now we just need a bit of red. Like my go-to red at the moment is this thing. Well, that one's perfect already. But if it's like like that, I think it might be better to just. But this is also perfect amount, right? That makes it like go straight up to that one. Um, wait, how much was the, the blue one that I had uh, again? That's like 12. Then we have here a one that is also 12. Now I just need a red one that's 12. Right? Yeah. Do I have one? Ye oh! Oh wait, no, never mind. No, that's 18. Oh wait! Instead of one of these, I could instead use one of you, and then one of you. Perfect. And that's gonna make the best uh, potion brewing uh, that we need. And I don't even need to like make fuel for that one, because that one's gonna be perfect like in, in the amount of time that we need. So there you go. Uh, right, that should be fine. Hmm. These use up like a lot of different uh, items, which uh, if you guys want to see what I used, was 
Okay, there you go. These are the, these are, blah, blah, blah. These are the seven items that we used. <laughs> Glass ore, mud shrimp, swamp octopus, uh, murk water pearl, horned jelly, sack of slime, and a walk pheromones. Which is all like we've gotten. We've gotten most of them from uh, from mint and from uh, Baptiste, and then we just gave them all to Quinn, so that we can always have read, uh, them ready for us. You know, that's always good. Uh, that's a lot of Mega Mint. That's almost all the uh, the maximum amount that I can put on this thing. But this is gonna be a greater one. Like it's absolutely gonna be a greater one because. Uh, if we get uh, like two stars up, so we're gonna get like at least over here to maybe over here. So maybe a one star grade up uh, poison cure, but that's fine. Um, anything else? I don't think so, right? What are some of the other ones that we have? Nothing that we need to take care of for now. So there you go. So that's that one I've done. I wish I had like a little bit more... What is it called? Um, Stuff to sell. Oh... I really don't have anything to sell. I need a, a second cauldron so I can keep making like the cheaper ones. I always have something to sell though. I think that might be a good idea. Like focus on trying to get like the uh... oh, tomorrow might be a good sell. <laughs> uh, increased value of fire tonics. I can't sell mine though. Like yeah, it is kind of good. Might end the day here. Yeah, I think that's what I will do. We don't have any potions to sell anyway. Like, we're so, so far away. And we never have any potions to sell. That's impressive. <laughs> Give me potions. <laughs> Give me money. I want to build my stuff. <laughs> uh, oh, well. And I'm pretty sure, like, Mind is going to stay away until uh, the end. So, that's... We can, you know what? Let's go say hello to everyone, because Muktuk does have like a um, what is it called? A rank up event. So I want to do that one. I can make time for a fellow artist. Thank you. Very nice. Crafter is indeed strange and delightful. Do you not find so too? In all of my travels, I have seen no place quite like it. Hmm, you've travelled a lot then? I have indeed, the Ferraris, but I'm not as so unusual for walrus. Those of us who seek excellence, see, who have who pursue a mystery, mastery in our chosen field, must undertake a great pilgrimage, and mine has brought me here. Oh, tell me more. I don't know much about walrus culture. Then I shall be glad to teach you. My homeland is a remote place, marked by its harsh climate. We are welcoming of train, uh, outsiders, yet receive few visitors. And so we take it upon ourselves to send our best and brightest out into the large world as missionaries and pilgrims. We travelers are charged with a great and holy purpose. We are meant to spread our expertise far and wide, to dedicate ourselves to service in foreign lands as a path to self-improvement and enlightenment. Some of us have devoted ourselves to medicine, some of us philosophy, while others have graded artworks of such in indescribable beauty you would weep to look upon them. Oh, is that why you're here? To share your artistic talent? You are correct. My pilgrimage has brought me to rougher shores, and here I shall remain until I have created a masterpiece. Mm, but to create something more remarkable than the land itself, mm, this will be the challenge. People will tell you that Rafter is a wild place, chaotic, but in fact, the opposite is true. For this island was built with intention, it was shaped by the hand of a powerful witch. Maven craved out the mountains, she charted the course of the rivers, the very flora and fauna have their origin in her lab. Oh, she had the right idea. 
I see the appeal of having a whole island to play with. I do as well. For the greater the canvas, the greater the impact. And then this is what Rafter means to me. It is a living artwork. Upon its very surface, I see the mark of its makers. Oh, I like a guy who knows what he likes. You're very passionate, aren't you? Ho ho ho, I cannot hide my enthusiasm for such topics. And I think that I should not try. Enthusiasm is like love or beauty. It is not diminished when it is shared. Oh. Ooh, that one is a heavy hitter. That's three, though, for 16. That's. I'll try to remember that when I'm back at the shop. A routine can make a difficulty, I know, but we must do all we can to muster enthusiasm for the beauty that is all about us. That is what travel teaches us, in the end, to look around with hungry eyes, to truly see a place. I divide joy in such all, and all that is different and strange and new. Yeah. Nice. I like the dialogue in this game, it's really good. There she is. Oh, you. You may like red stuff, right? So do you like this bulb? Seeing you is gift enough. Okay, that tells me nothing. <laughs> it's like, oh yes, do you like this gift? Oh, um, no. It's okay. Let's go visit uh, Quinn then again. I don't think I've given them a gift yet. Uh, and I have not. Do I have anything that's like, good? They, do, they did seem to like green stuff. Do I have anything that's like green and powerful? Or maybe they like the... What I what have I given them last time? I get, Oh, I gave them a plant. Okay. How about this one? <laughs> Alright, Sylvia. Cheers. Oh, they like that one. That's very good. Got a bit of everything. Yep, I know. That's why I come here to buy your stuff. Hmm. Okay, everything else is a little bit too expensive for now. Come on. If you're wondering why I have so many troubles with the uh, the mouse, it's because I have a touchpad. It's a tiny touchpad too, because I'm using a deck. Uh, I'm using my Steam Deck. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna buy one of the of each of these, you know, and one of these. Back to zero we go. <laughs> but that's fine. Good night. As we are also going to end it here. So then everyone, thank you guys for watching. Oh, wait. I wonder if Owl knows how to sweep. Oh, hello there. Oh, Mint, hello. Hi, Mint. Need a potion? M maybe later. I'm actually here to talk about something a little awkward. I don't like to gossip about people, but I also don't believe in keeping secrets. Sometimes it can be impossibly bind. Whatever you need to tell me, I can keep it in confidence. It's about Roxanne. I know you shall schedule to go up against her in the competition, and I think she's up to something. Uh, she definitely has a up to no good air about her, but it sounds like you're trying to, talking about something specific. Yeah, one of my guildmates brought up uh, some healing potions from her recently. He paid a, pre a pretty sum for them. When I shared one with an injured colleague, it didn't work. It didn't do anything at all. Oh, big, big yikes! I know we got into some deep, a pretty dangerous situation. So a faulty health potion is a big deal. It could have been really bad, Sylvia. Fortunately, the injury uh, this time, the injury in question was just a paper cut. There are lots of paper cups since Baptiste started routine, routing so many forms. Hmm. So you're saying that Rosanne's potions aren't very effective? It's more than that. After that, what happened? I'm not even. I'm not sure they even are potions. I brought my concern up to Baptiste, but he said an inquiry would take weeks. It wouldn't be done in time to help you. Hmm. <laughs> You've helped me just by make, uh, coming to me with this. Now I'm sure I'm the better potion maker. And I refuse to lose to a phony. If I wasn't fi fired up before, I sure am now. Good, because I'm ro ro rooting for you, Sylvia. 
And I'm not the only one. We have fans, I like that. <laughs> but anyway, as I was saying, this is gonna be the end of the, the episode. Um, two more episodes, so... Oh, and then we have the, the big compet... Oh, one more episode, and then after that one we have the big competition. Uh, we can't even make like a ton of money tomorrow either, because we don't have anything. <laughs> oh, I hope it goes well. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And as always, I hope to see you next time. Um, bye!